What is up, ladies and gentlemen? Poketristy here, bringing you guys episode number three of our Pokemon Sapphire Randomizer Nuzlocke Challenge. And I almost said learning laddering, and that would have been a big mistake, and I would have had to start over. Anyways, <laughs> welcome back. Uh, if you guys missed out on the last episode, the link is in the description below. We caught some powerful team members. Um, yeah, go check it out, man. I don't have a layout on this uh, Let's Play. I know that I've heard a couple of people, uh, or I've seen... You know, some people have asked me about a layout, and I don't have one. I don't have one for this. Uh, I'm going to probably try to do it for the next Let's Play, but not this one, not this one, not this one. So, um, yeah, no spoilers unless you guys watch up until the, the uh, team recap. I did do some grinding. Everybody is up to level 15 except for a couple of mods, and I'll explain why. And there's also something I want to bring to your attention. As it did happen during the grinding montage, I know it kind of seems a little shady, but I can promise you guys that it isn't. So, I want to show you guys what happened. So I was grinding, right? And I picked up this. The experience chair. I picked it up on accident. So I'm going to show you where I got it. Alright. This item right here was the experience chair. My mouse is on the screen. I, 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 Eventually, guys, I'm going to not do that. But the item, the experience chair, the item in question. Well, hold on. The item in question was right here. It was this sitting right here. There was an item sitting here last time we were here. I know there was. And uh, this time it's gone, so it was the experience share. I got lucky. What can I say? I mean, obviously it's happened a couple of times so far. I've gotten pretty lucky, so uh, I just want to let you guys know that I did pick up the experience share. That it was it was just it was there. That was it. That was where it was. So that helped with grinding a little bit, uh, not too terribly much, but it did help some. Anyway, I'm gonna go through the team recap. Everybody, like I said, is up to level uh, 15, with some exceptions here and there. Uh, anyway. Ivysaur Thickums is our first Pokemon. Uh, careful Nature Thickums with Overgrow. Not holding any items. He has Sleep Powder, Poison Powder, Leech Seed, and Vine Whip. So I got rid of Tackle and I got rid of Growl for Sleep Powder and Poison Powder. I hope that it comes in handy. What can I say? All that residual damage with Leech Seed and Poison Powder. Um, I didn't mean to go over. Next up, we have Kyogre. Careful Nature with the Drizzle ability, as always. Uh, level 13. Now, why did I not level him up to be the the same level as everyone else because he's a legendary and you know i mean he's already good enough like look at the stat difference look it's insane the stat difference i know that the cries are going crazy but still stat difference is insane anyway still has water pulse and scary face didn't learn any moves i think he learns another move at 15 i think next up we have our salamence salamence is a brave nature with the intimidate ability no moxie for us <laughs> Um, Salamence, I did get leveled up to 15, even though he is a pseudo. I leveled him up to 15 anyway. Uh, he has a, a 55 attack. That's crazy. Rage, Bite, Leer, and Headbutt. Still his moveset. No new moves for Salamence either. Next up, we have Bella, our Zubat. Bella is a naughty nature with inner focus. Uh, the attack and everything else is just pretty meh. I mean, Bella is probably the worst member of the team right now. I hate to say that, but it has Leech Life, Supersonic, Astonish, and Bite. Uh, did learn some new moves, so that's cool, but uh, still pretty bad. Anyway, next up we have Chili, the Electable, with uh, it's a sassy nature with static and um, pretty good stats all around. I would say defense is pretty low, but other than that, quick attack, near and Thunder Punch still. No new moves for Electabuzz. Uh, there were actually Elekids up in that route as well, so I'm really glad we found this one instead. I'm really glad we found Electabuzz instead. Next up, we have our starter, Tinkerbell, the Celebi. Uh, naughty Nature, Natural Cure as an ability. And um, the stats are pretty nice. Uh, they're not necessarily as good as Kyogre's, but it is base 100 across the board, so uh, it's still the same moveset. Didn't learn anything else. So that is the team, ladies and gentlemen. And the first thing we're going to do today is take on the gym. That is the first thing we're going to do. So, Roxanne, better be ready for us because we're coming in there hot, all right? I, sh I really shouldn't battle all the trainers in here because uh, I am overleveled as it is. So I think what I'm going to do is just go ahead and skip these guys. I know it's kind of meh to do that. You guys might be frustrated and upset with me for doing that, but it's okay. We're going to go ahead and battle Roxanne. I forgot to give her a voice. I don't really do girl voices good. I became a gym leader so that I may apply what I learned at the Pokemon Trainer School in battle. Would you kindly demonstrate how you battle with your Pokemon? Yeah, see, I don't do girl voices. They all turn British for some reason. I'm not sure why. It's really weird. Anyway, Roxanne is going to have a Gulpin. Um, which means I can just switch out into, to Tinkerbell. Hopefully it doesn't have a poison type move, like Sludge Bomb. goes for Yawn. Uh, I'm going to go for Confusion and just kill this thing. Hoping... Oh, wow. He lived. Wow. It lived. I'm going to try to wake up. 
Oh wait, why did I do that? I could have just switched out. I'm gonna go for confusion again. Hit yourself. Perfect. So, can I wake up? Wow. Roxanne's just spamming potions. Anyway, confusion's definitely not killing this. It's really bulky, but I'll be able to kill it this turn. Roxanne wasted both of her potions, luckily for us, and Gulpin is gonna go down to our uh, Tinkerbell. That's pretty nice. Curlia is gonna come out. Curlia, I think Salamence can handle. I'm actually gonna go into Bella. I'm gonna go into Bella. I'm gonna let Bella handle this. I'm gonna let Bella handle this. I'm gonna go for a Supersonic first. Of course we miss. Confusion. Shouldn't do that much. I forgot that I'm poison. <laughs> I just completely forgot that I was poison. For some reason I thought I was bug flying. Wow. So, I would first like to apologize to every fan of Zubat out there. Um, that's my bad. Uh, I really am sorry. Wow, I just completely spaced on the fact that we're poison. I don't know what I was doing going into Zubat. I thought Zubat could handle it. He missed the supersonic. I'm not reading her text because she killed one of her Pokemon. That's something that Shady Penguin does, and I think that's something that uh that everyone should do because that's disgusting for her to kill your Pokemon. Anyway, <sighs> that's so stupid. That makes me so frustrated because I shouldn't have lost Zubat. That is really annoying. I spent all that time grinding Zubat up too. <sighs> Even worse. All right, well, this is not going to contain Rock Tomb. It's going to contain a different move. I do want to see what move it is before we place Zubat in its final resting place. Takedown. That's recoil, though. If I get a normal type, I might do that, but... Anyway. Oh, yeah, I forgot. Get out of the way! Wait, please! Don't take my goods! <laughs> Don't take my goods. What the heck? Oh, my God, what is this game? Anyway. Sadness is upon us, boys and girls, as we have to... We have to deposit our Zubat... We have to name our box, too. So, I am a big fan of anime, if you guys don't know. I'm a big fan of anime, um, and this is going to be a reference from one of my favorite anime. Animes? Anime? I don't know. This is going to be a reference from one of my favorites, so let me know if you get it. If you do, that's awesome. If you don't, it's not alright. It's, it's, you know, it's not bad. It's not so bad. Anyway. Unfortunately, well, the thing about it is Zubat really didn't fit into the party because we have a lot of power and Crobat is nice but not powerful. I don't know why I thought I was flying bug for a second. I just don't think of Zubat as being a poison type. Can you blame me? I mean, like, can you honestly blame me? I don't think you can. I mean, you can blame me, but... Oh, it's you! You're the fantastic trainer who helped me in Petalbrook Woods. Help me! I'm being robbed by Team Aqua. They have to get the Devon Scoots back. If I don't, I'm going to be in some serious trouble. You derp. You derp. How do you lose stuff, huh? How do you lose stuff? What? How's the, how do things get stolen from you? Talk to me. I'm gonna run. No, I'm not. Alright, anyway. We're gonna go up here. I didn't battle any of these trainers, though, so... Uh, we're gonna have to battle some of them. I mean, it's just free experience, really, but... Yeah. It's just free experience. I'm gonna speed up through these battles. Crobat. Salt in the wound. I don't know why I stayed in. Salt in the wound, ladies and gentlemen. Anyway... Yeah. Sigh. That makes me sad. That makes me sad. Why am I leading with Thickums? I should lead with Kyogre, since he's underleveled. Obviously, he's the strongest member of the team, but he is underleveled, technically, so. I'm not going to battle as many of them as I can. Like, I mean, I'm going to I'm gonna do my best to miss some of them. Like that. <laughs> uh, and there's Mr. Briny. Oh, wait, i got to go with this item over here. Hold on. I'm gonna go get this item. What is this? Thick Club. Can I find a Marowak, please? Mar Marowak would be pretty nice. I wouldn't mind catching one of those. Anyway, uh, we are gonna go up in here. Mr. Briny is gonna stop us. Oh, what am I to do? We were on a walk, Pico and I, when we were jumped by an odd thug. The scoundrel made off with my darling Pico. Roar! Why is he saying roar? <laughs> Oh my god, why is he saying roar? <laughs> what? I don't. I. <laughs> Pico! Ho! 
Oh, what am I to do? Wait, huh? I already talked to you. Wait, he already said that once. Alright, whatever. Anyway, this is the first encounter. Wait, we don't have any Pokeballs. Ooh. I almost messed up. I gotta go buy some Pokeballs. I really almost messed up. That's crazy. Anyway. Uh, well, my, I might have to battle these guys, these guys now. That's kind of annoying, but whatever. I just forgot Pokeballs, so blame me. So, uh, yeah. This has been... This has been an, a very eventful episode so far. <sighs> I can't believe I lost Crobat. Or, not Crobat. I can't believe I lost Zubat. I always do that. I always name pre-evolutions, like, their, their final evolution names. Anybody else do that? I feel like I'm the only... Whoa. Why are there so many Deoxuses in this game? They're everywhere. It's crazy. Anyway, I'm gonna go buy some uh, Pokeballs. I'm glad that guy doesn't, like, stop you and say, Wait, you can't. You have to go help me. That's good. Why do I... No. Alright, cool. I'm gonna buy... 15 Pokeballs. I think that's... Wait, wait, wait. Yeah, I think I think 15 is fine. I think I'm gonna buy 15 Pokeballs. Then I'm gonna buy some Super Potions. Uh, as I actually went into... Roxanne's gym without any potions, I just realized. So that was that could have been really bad for us. Uh, luckily, though, I made do and we actually made it. I'm going to hurry up and speed up and get back there, though. I don't feel like wasting all this time of Feebas. Nice. Nice and give me zero experience. There was, so many, there was some power on this route, though. There was Vaporeons. There were Slackings. Uh, there was the Dratinis. Like, there was a lot of uh, pretty powerful Pokemon on this route. I mean, Dratini's not powerful, but Dragonite is. So, anyway... Um, I'm not going to leave with Kyogre uh, to catch a Pokemon. I'm probably going to lead with Thickums. Um, that way I can put it to sleep. And then maybe hit it with a Vine Whip if it's not super effective. Anyway, I'm going to do my best to get up here and get this item before we encounter. Uh, we did find it. It's a Scope Lens. What does that do? Does that raise accuracy? I feel like it does. Um, raises the critical hit ratio. Oh, wow. That's actually useful. Um, anyway, I guess we can get our encounter after I battle this guy. Alright, we didn't find any Pokemon. Wow. So we'll battle this guy first. I didn't do his, uh, I didn't do his dialogue. Sorry. I was just kind of surprised that we didn't find a Pokemon first. So anyway, out comes Snow Runt. Um, yeah, I do not want to stay in against you. I am going to go out into my only Ice Resist, which is uh, Kyogre, so... Powder Snow is not going to do any damage to me. I'm going to Water Pulse your face. Goodbye. Why is he level 11 when we just got done beating the... Well, you know... Mm, no, no, no. Why is he level 11? He shouldn't be. That plan is not right. The boss told me that this would be a slick and easy job to pull. A slick and easy job. A slick and... Okay. All I had to do was steal some package from Devin. <laughs> you want it back that badly? Take it. Alright. Thanks. It's poppin' Pico. Pico, am I glad you're safe? Pico was a life to you. They call me Mr. Briny, and you are... Ellipses, 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 ellipses. Huh, so you're Tricity. I didn't say that, I said ellipses. I sincerely thank you. Now, if there's anything that troubles you, don't hesitate to tell me. You can usually find me in my cottage by the sea, near Petalburg Woods. Come, Pico. We should make our way home. Wingo! I don't actually know Wingo's cry. <laughs> I mean, obviously that was Wingo's cry, but I don't actually know, like, the anime cry for Wingo. Weird. Anyway, hopefully we can find a first encounter in here before we leave. Alright, cool. <laughs> and our first encounter in here is an oddish. Nice and oddish. Um... Well, luckily, I can still put you to sleep in this gen. Well, if I can hit. If I can hit. Alright, cool. So, we are going to put Otis to sleep and just throw some Pokeballs at it. I don't think I can actually touch it. So, I'm just going to throw a Pokeball or two. And Otis is going to stay in the ball. So, um. Vile Plume or Bell Awesome? I'm going to name this Sombrero. And I'm going to turn this into a Vile Plume if I get the chance. I'm going to name it Sombrero because it looks like it's wearing a Sombrero. Yeah, I think that's how you spell Sombrero. If it's not, then I'm sorry. I've just proved my ignorance if it's not, but... Okay. There's an item up here as well. I'm sorry, I forgot about it. Oh. Huh? Oh, okay. Whoops. 
All right, well, I've proved my ignorance once again <laughs> to all of you. I'm sorry. Uh, anyway, we can now get in here, which I don't know why he was blocking it in the first place. Uh, they don't do anything for you. They're all like triplets, aren't they? I don't actually know. What's your story, guys? What, did, what is your story? Anyway, oh yeah, there was Shellgons here too. I forgot to mention. Oh, we haven't battled her. Uh, Caterpie. Vine Whip. Yeah. Nice. If he'd have ripped out like X Scissor or Bug Bite, that would have probably been bad. I mean, we would have lived, obviously, because it is, it is a Caterpie and we're a, a Ivysaur, but still. Oh, how did it go? The Devon Goods. You did it! I didn't. I clicked A too fast. My bad. You really are a great trainer! Duh. I already, you already showed you. I already showed you that I was a great trainer. What are you talking about? I know. As my thanks, I'll give you another Great Ball. Give me a Master Ball. Great Balls are useless. I'm just kidding. This is the Devon Corporation's third floor. Our president's office is on this floor. Anyway, I can't tell you how much I'm grateful for what you've done. Um, by the way, that parcel you got back for us, can I get you to deliver that in the shipyard at Slateport? It would be awful if those robbers tried to take it again. Uh, hee 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 Oh, that's right. Could you wait here a second? Hurry up. Our president would like to have a word with you. Please come with me. Please go ahead. Yo, they made Mr. Stone in, in Omega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire, they made him look so awesome in comparison to, like, regular old man standing on top of a couch. You know? They made him so cool. Anyway. I'm Mr. Stone, the president of the Devon Corporation. I just got word about you. You shaved, you, you shaved our staff. <laughs> oh my god. You've saved our staff not once, but twice. I have a favor to ask of an amazing person like you. I'm changing his voice. I don't want it to be too much like Steven, because Steven's going to have like the same voice, except it's going to be a little lighter. You know? I don't know. I understand that you're delivering a package to Slateboard while on the way. Could you stop it off in Doofa Town? I was hoping that you'd deliver a letter to Steven. Sure. <laughs> Alright, guys. This is episode number three of our Pokemon Favor Edition. <laughs> Randomized Nuzlocke. Anyway. No, you should know that I'm a great president. So I'd never be as cheap to ask for favor with blah, 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 blah. Hard sentences. That's why I want you to have this. Oh, gee, thanks. I'm sure going to use that a lot, buddy. It's a Pokemon Navigator. Or Pokenap for short. Clever. It's an indispensable tool for any trainer on an adventure. That's why I never use it. It has a map of the Hoenn region. Eh, okay. Alright, maybe I'll use it. You can check the locations of Doofit and Slateport easily. I already know where they are. Good way. Why are you guys still... Why won't you... Why don't you, um... Teleport me down to the bottom of the place. Anyway, it doesn't matter. We're out of here now. Why do all the workers look the same? All the scientists look the same, and then all the other guys look the same, too. Anyway, we're going to go down here. I think May is down here. She doesn't battle us here, though, I don't think. I'm going to heal up just in case. That's not the Pokemon Center. <laughs> I'm going to heal up just in case. Um, all right, cool. I don't think she battles here, but just in case. I'm, I think she doesn't. Boy, I'm stupid. Um, what are you doing? I can't do girl voices. Oh, hi, Tristy. How's your Pokedex coming along? Mine's looking pretty decent. I caught a Pokemon in Petalburg Woods until I ran out of Pokeballs. Caught multiple of them. Great. Good. I mean, you're not nuzlocke obviously. Why are you standing here? What is your purpose? Well, where did these two come from? Oh, I gotta get Cut. It's here, isn't it? Whoops. My bad. Isn't this the... Yeah, Cutter's house. That is... um, That's something. <laughs> the Cutter's house? Gosh... Calm down. We gotta, we gotta call the man out. All right, yeah, I know. I'm a skill trainer. Blah blah blah. I don't think Zubat learns cut, and I don't want to teach cut to one of my things, one of my things, one of my Pokemon. So I think I'm going to catch a uh, slave. That is, that is allowed, by the way. In this, oh, I think Oddish can learn cut. Um, that is allowed, by the way. I'm gonna let HM slaves be allowed because, I mean, why not, right? Anyway, I can just, I can like teach Oddish. I can, like, get it untaught. I don't know what I'm looking... I don't know what I'm trying to say. Anyway, I'm going to go up here. Uh, there is a, there's, There are items up here. I just have to cut and battle a couple of people, and I want these items. So, yeah. 
I mean, because I could be giving up on a Master Ball that's, like, right there. So, there's no reason for me to not go up here and battle some people to, just to get the item. So, that's what I'm going to do. Um, actually, I don't even think I have to battle them. I think I can I think I think can weave my way through here without battling anyone. Yeah, I can. Nice. Because I didn't want to battle them anyway. You guys already know. I mean, we're already pretty, pretty high leveled as it is. Ah, nice. <laughs> nice in potion. We're getting some Chesto berries, though. Resto Chesto. I need to teach one of my Pokemon rest. Can I get this a berry, please? Pineapple berries. Uh, I can't say I know what they do. I like how they're shaped like a pineapple, kind of, though. That's nice. I see you, Pokemon Sapphire. I see you, Game Freak. Good job. All right, anyway, we're going to hurry down here now because I took too long doing that nonsense. And uh, I can actually... Oh, there's berries over here. Does this one in battle you? Okay, maybe not. Lepa berries I'll take, and uh, cherry berries I'll take as well. I love how they just use, like, normal names for things, and they just, like, change the spelling. I think it's really funny. Anyway, uh, this is a timer ball. Alrighty. Timer balls could be useful. I've actually, if you guys are familiar with the stream, then you know. I mean, I caught a time, I caught a Pokemon, a really nice Pokemon in a timer ball, so timer balls can be useful. They definitely can be. A Porygon would have been so cool in here. But I got my Ivysaur in here, so I'm happy with that. Uh, what's this chick doing? Did she teach you, a, like, a move or something? No, probably not. A Bellu Berry. So basically a Blueberry. See what I mean? Nice originality, Game Freak. I see you. I see you, Game Freak. I see you. Snake in the grass. Oh, 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 there's an item up there. Ooh, a camera up. You get a Mega Evolve? A Calcium. Oh, okay. Not bad. That's respectable. Um, isn't there... No, there's not a... No. Okay, we're good. So we're gonna go here. I don't remember what level Brawly's Pokemon are. Uh, hold on. Let me... Can I... Oh, are you kidding me, Pico? All right, Briny, stop walking around. <laughs> Hold on, lass. Wait up, Pico. Hmm? Your electricity. You saved my darling Pico. We owe you so much. What's that? You? Uh, whoops! I pressed A too fast. <laughs> hmm. You have a letter bound for Duford and a package for Slate Port. Then, quite the busy life you must lead. No, I just do a bunch of favors for people. It's stupid. <laughs> but suddenly, what you're asking is no problem at all. You come to the right man. We'll set sail for Duford. All right. Duford, here we come. Anchors away. Pico, we're setting sail, my darling. Pico's not just gonna chill. All right. So we're gonna get there fast. Uh, this actually gives me a good chance to look up uh, what's his name's levels. I think Brawly's look like what 18 and 19. I think. I do want to look it up just just to be safe because I don't think I want to battle Brawly this episode. I'm kind of scared of him. We can do all the stuff in the uh, cave though. Anyway, uh, 17 and 18 is Brawly. Okay, so I was almost, almost right. I think we can actually handle Brawly. We can battle the guys in the gym. I think we can handle Brawly. I think we can do that this episode. Yeah, we can definitely do it this episode. It might be a longer episode. Why am I healing up? <laughs> Why am I healing up? All right. We have a buku ton of encounters. Uh, yo, we can get so many encounters. Yo. Oh, what am I doing? I hate everything. All right, I got, I'm going to register the rod, though. I'm glad that thing reminded me, kind of. Didn't really remind me, but you know what I mean. So, uh, wait, no, I just want to register. Oh, okay. I just pressed select. I thought that worked, but alas, it does not. All right, so Route 107, our first encounter. I meant to press select, and I didn't. All right, cool. All right. Anticlimactic. We're fishing in the same spot. I don't care if we didn't catch anything the first time. We're going to catch something. We definitely are. Nice! Let's see what it is. Our first encounter in Route 107. Wow. Yo. That is really interesting. Uh, I'm going to Leech Seed. I didn't mean to Leech Seed. I meant to Sleep Powder. My bad. I said Leech Seed. That's, uh, that was a mistake. Um, I am going to go into Chili because I don't think this thing can actually hurt me. I'm going to Thunder Punch. It shouldn't kill. All right, good. Now I'm going to Quick Attack. Why did I do that? I didn't think it was going to kill... I'm so bad at this game. I could have had a Sceptile sitting in my box. I'm bad. I'm bad at Pokemon. I'm bad at Pokemon. <sighs> Do for town. Give me something good. I'm so stupid. Oh my god. I am sick to my stomach now. That's two stupid things I've done this episode. <laughs> I sometimes am just too good. If I don't catch something now. Alright, good. Thank you. I want a Fire-type. Totodile. 
What is up with all the starters? <laughs> what is up with all the starters? Alright, I'm not killing this. Um, I'm sleep powdering. And I just have to throw Pokeballs. Wait, no! Oddish! Oddish can cut a hundred times. I bet I can absorb at least once, but I'm not going to. Alright, don't kill my Oddish. Alright, good. One more cut? I'm scared. I'm gonna throw a Pokeball. I'm scared to cut again. I'm just gonna throw a Pokeball at this. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Calm down, Totodile. I said calm down, Totodile. Alright, so we're gonna go back into Thickums. Scratch was doing way too much. I'm gonna put this thing to sleep. Then I'm gonna throw some Pokeballs at it. A for alligator would be a really, really powerful Pokemon. Po that bleh, powerful Pokemon to add to the box. Uh, come on, please, please, Totodile. I keep, see. I said for alligator. I said it again. I always do that. I always, I always call them by their evolutions. I don't know why. Please stay in the ball. Oh, are you kidding me, Totodile? What do I have to do? Please don't do this. Please don't make me spend all my Pokeballs. Oh my goodness. I want to use I want to use my timer ball, but I'm scared because I might need it. I'm I'm gonna throw another Pokeball. I need to, I need to out stay in the ball like that. Oh, <gasps> we got him! Let's go. That is power. Yo, that's awesome. Uh, give a nickname. Yes, we're gonna name it. Uh, I know a lot of people name their Totodiles Fred, like Fred Flintstone. So I am gonna be a hipster and I'm gonna name mine Barney because of Barney Rubble. Because everybody always forgets about Barney Rubble. Barney. I think that's how he said his name. I don't remember. Anyway, it doesn't matter. Let's go check out Totodile, actually. I want to go check Totodile out and see, uh, see what he's working with. You're not supposed to be in there. <laughs> that's not your resting place. Your resting place is here. You're alive. Alright, so uh, Torrent, Impish Nature. Uh, it's, I don't know what Impish does. Scratch and Leer. I have no idea what Impish does. I really need to learn my natures. I need like a nature chart sitting on my computer so that I'll remember all of my natures. Uh, but I don't have that. So anyway, we're going to get another encounter up here in Route 106. Yeah, Route 106. Can I... Does he turn forward? I don't think he does. So I'm going to do this. He does. Dang it. I wanted to fish beside him. You know what? I'm going to battle him and then I'm going to fish beside him. Cause he's a fisherman. He's gonna give me good luck. Okay then, Trico. Uh, let's switch on to Kyogre. I, I mean, obviously I know it's not... I just want to get Kyogre some levels. This thing can't kill me because I'm a legendary Kyogre. I, if it was a Sceptile, I wouldn't have done that, but a Trico is fine. Alright, so I'm gonna fish right beside the fisherman. Because he's gonna give me good luck. Alright, fisherman. What am I gonna get? What am I gonna get? A bite. It's on the hook. What is it? Please be something good. Wow. Okay. That's something good. Uh, steel types are really rare in this gen. Um, I didn't heal up my Oddish. So I'm going to use a potion to heal up Oddish because I definitely need Oddish to be alive. Or er, not alive. I definitely need to be healed up against this because this thing is scary. He went for Screech. Please don't do that. Don't wake up turn one anymore, please. I'm going to go into Oddish, and I'm going to go for an Absorb and see how much it does. It shouldn't do that much. That, okay, it didn't do that much. Don't crit, Oddish. Okay. Don't screech all of my Pokemon, please. Yo, does this thing learn Heavy Slam? I bet it does. Does it learn Heavy Slam by level up? It has to, right? It has to. So I put this thing to sleep. That's good. Um, I'm going to go into Oddish and go for a couple of cuts. I want to get this thing to red so bad. As long as he doesn't know takedown, we're fine. Screech. Stop this, Steelix. Do I live one tackle? Probably not. I'm going to go back into Thickums. I'm sorry this is like kind of repetitive, but I really want to catch this Steelix. This is an amazing Pokemon to add to the team. The team... Yo, the, how powerful would our team be? That's insane. This is going to be such a powerhouse team. You guys are going to hate my guts. I'm going to get it down to a little bit lower. All right. I can't actually risk, uh, risk him critting, so... I'm going to throw a Pokeball. I don't think it's going to catch, but just, you know, Pokeball number one. You know, we'll see. One, two, three. <gasps> we got him! Oh, my lord. That is such power. The Iron Snake Pokemon. I did not know that's what it's called. Wow. The Iron Snake. 
Steelix lives in even further underground than Onyx. This Pokemon is known to dig toward the Earth's core. Wow. There are records of this Pokemon reaching a depth over six tenths of a mile underground. Wait, six tenths of a mile. That doesn't seem like a lot. <laughs> is it a lot? I'm sure it's a lot. It doesn't seem like a lot, though. Um. What do I name a Steelix? Obviously, Stainless is a name that, that's a cool name. Uh. What do I name this thing? What do I name this? Um. I don't actually know what to name it. Dig search the Earth's core. Um, I'm gonna just name it Core. You know what? I'm gonna name it Core the Steelix because I'm not original. I don't have any good nicknames for anything yet. Uh, so I'm gonna name it Core the Steelix, and we are gonna go check out Core the Steelix immediately. That's a really exciting encounter for us. That's a really exciting capture. So I'm gonna check him out. Check it out. I heal up too. Why not? Right. Anyway, let's, uh, let's, let's, because I'm probably going to take Oddish and, uh, take Steelix instead, obviously. Um, the next Pokemon that we get replaced if I find something amazing will be, uh, Ivysaur, unfortunately. Just because Celebi is our grass type, even though it doesn't know any grass type moves, uh, I think Celebi's a better Pokemon, obviously, than Venusaur. I didn't mean to press that button. Alright. Hasty Nature, does that raise speed? That's garbage. <laughs> Um, alright, so Steelix is level 5, Tackle and Screech. Um, that's awesome. I can teach him Takedown, too, because he's got Rock Head. Yo, Steelix is amazing. That's an amazing addition to the team. Um, so I think what I'm going to do now is end the episode off right here, because we can start off episode... Get out of my way! I'm trying to end... Bruh. Alright, I'm leaving. I'm going to end the episode somewhere else. I'm going to end the episode somewhere else. Can I get in there? Aw, uh, that would have been cool. I always want to end the episode somewhere fun. Like, except for last episode I didn't because I'm a bad Pokemon player. Slash bad YouTuber. Slash bad everything else. Alright, we're going to end the episode right here. Can you see me? Can you see where I... Can you see me? Alright, anyway. We're going to end the episode right here. If you guys enjoy, make sure you leave a like. Make sure you comment, subscribe. All that good stuff down below. Make sure that you are... Uh, prepared for episode number four which will come out um monday monday it'll come out monday i don't know why i just like lost my train of thought completely but episode number four comes out on monday so make sure that you are uh stayed tuned to the channel as well as all of the other things that we do on the channel links for everything is down below and all that good stuff so uh hopefully next episode we will get another encounter in the cave as well as take on brawly and make our way to um slateport so Hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, like I said, leave a like, comments, all that good stuff. And I will see you guys in the next video. I'm out.